Hello there and welcome back to Let's Play Owlboy. I'm the Aryan Genius, but you may call me Eric. And in the last episode, we have been fending off the pirate attack and we made it into the Dreadnought. Now we just need to find the bomb supply and then blow it all up. Taking out the Dreadnought, taking out the fleet, taking out the everything. How we're gonna do that? How are we gonna find out in a second, aren't we? What up? Otis, one of these doors should lead to the Dreadnought's engine. When you find it, we'll help you destroy it. Never mind bomb stuff. Uh, I'm gonna feed the Dreadnought uh, engine, of course. So it falls down from the sky and then the fleet is taken out, of course. That's what I meant. Huh. One of these doors, huh? Well, there's only one open one, so let's hope that's the one. Otherwise, we are hosed. Looking good so far. Uh, looking very good so far. Man, that is not green technology right there. Do you see those black clouds? What are they thinking? What are they thinking? They must hate environment. Guys, look! It's a Dreadnought's engine! <clears throat> we we made it! We actually made it! Let's rig this thing up and... I'm on it! Err. Alright, you guys, this thing is rigged to blow! Excellent work, Eddie! Now we should probably get out of here. We did it! We stopped the pirates! Indeed, now let's go. We saved Advent and all the people! We're the best team ever! True, true, but let's get moving. We are heroes, you guys! We... Uh-oh. What? Oh my. Oh no, this is bad. This is really bad. Otis, Getty! Oh, we have to get out of here quickly! Don't fret, team. Leave this one to me. Oh, snap. Oh, let's not. No, let's not. Ooh! Good job in there, pal. No, not that great. Oh! The escape route is shot. What now? Oh, friggin' hell. Ah, another exit! But I won't be able to reach it. Otis! Otis! Otis, please get up! Master Otis, we need to escape. Come on now, Master Otis. We'll need to gather our courage and get out of here. Yeah, courage and stuff. What up here, though? I think this gate is locked. Oh, no. Why is everything on fire? Uh, oh, hurts. Spin. Oh, my lord. Oh, it hurts. Ow, 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 ow. I hate fire. Oh, nice. Conveniently placed elevator. Can't believe that thing was still working. I mean, it was all mechanical stuff, but, uh... Ha! Ha ha ha! We made it! It's just a... It's just a question of time before the Dreadnought sinks! Hmm. <laughs> you guys sure are something else. Even in a real rough spot, we seem to be a pretty good team. After this, I will no longer find a place among the pirates. Instead, I will find comfort among friends. True friends. But let's not linger here. Let's take to the skies. Master Otis, would you mind? Quickly, let's! Alphonse. Ha <laughs> Why, this makes sense. How else would these buffoons b b get through our defenses? You've been helping them all along. And here you all are. I'll finally be able to get revenge for your betrayal. 
Step back, he's all mine. I hope that would you, th I hope that you would come to see sense. All this destruction, this chaos. Is this really what you were created for? <sighs> I suppose we shall have to fight here. The captain! He's here! Uh, ma Ma Maulstrom! Master Otis, we must escape at once. Grab Master Gedney and fly. I'll go on ahead. Come on, Otis, let's. Captain Maulstrom, sir. What are you doing on deck? Get back to your posts at once. Otis, get up. Oh, no. Otis! You have to fly away. Oh. I'll try and stall him! Ah, oh. Fools! Can't you see your capital burn? Take a good look! Otis, no! Time has come at last! You will get to watch! Behold the destruction of Advent! Medicines, medicine and supplies, quickly! Look for survivors! Alright, take the food over here. We need more scaffolding for the tents! Lumber here! We need more water! Oh, I want to read the diary. <sighs> huh? Otis, you're awake! I'm so happy you're okay. You were all beaten up when I found you. Oh, this is all so horrible. Those poor people from Advent. We're, we're, we're taking on as many refugees as we can. And luckily the owls from Advent are here as well. Strix and his students are doing a really good job. We're all doing what we can, but, well... Azio's out by the looking point. Look out point, it's just... He's been there for days and... He doesn't speak to anyone. Maybe he'll talk to you, Otis? Would you mind checking up on him out there? At this rate, I worry he might end up leaving the village. Uh... And Getty, he's... Um... He's down by the... The... <laughs> graveyard. I guess our village has come, ha has one of those now. We've located, we've located it below the village down there. Hmm. Oh, Otis, it's as if, if the village has lost all its colors and brightness. I hope everything will turn out all right. He's not dead. He's by the graveyard. He doesn't have his grave on the graveyard. I wasn't sure if I should write a diary entry today, but I figured I should. I've taken Otis in to recover in my house where we can take care of him. I can only hope that he's still himself when he wakes up. As for the rest of us... 
I think we might never be the same. Otis is still sleeping. I wonder how much we should tell him about what happened. I don't want to lie to him, but if I tell him everything... What if he blames himself for all of this tragedy? He's just a child. Otis is still sleeping. Dude, I've seen stuff. I'm not just a child. So many people lost their homes. We have to do our best to help them settle here in the in valley. Oh, but you should rest until you've recovered, Otis. You should. You still look a little frail. You look frail. Looking frail. You say that to my face. You don't do that. There. I. I really hope Getty's okay. I've never seen him like this. Distraught. Ever since I met him, he's always been the happy guy, you know. The guy that makes you want to pl play a little melody. I'm sorry, Otis. I'm just a little worrier. <laughs> my beautiful house in Advent is lost. My avery, my paintings, my avery, my paintings. Only I and Chirpy made it out. My relatives said that they'd escape eastward. I hope they made it out before the pirate captain appeared. My relatives said they were headed eastward. How are we, how are we doing on supplies? Um, this is all there is, Sir Strix. This is it. This village's supplies wouldn't w won't even last a week. Preposterous! Azia has done a luckluster job here at best. We need to start planning a long-term solution for all of Advent's refugees. Comfort is secondary. Survival's top priority. Mm, yes, sir. Huh? Oh, I don't believe we've met. Forgive me, I have to make sure I don't miss any shipments. I'm grateful that I have been allowed to stay in Valley. We'll have to do our best job to help the village grow. <laughs> we only have enough supplies for about a week or so. We'll either have to plant new crops or evacuate. Hmm. Ah, Otis. It is good to see you have come to. You have come to. As you can see, we're trying to cope with a poor state a state your mentor has left this village in. We never allowed such incompetence in Edwind. But fret not, little one. With our guidance, we may get your village to uh, up to snuff yet. My students, Fib and Bonacci, are highly trained in good goods tra tra transport. Being Azio's student, I wouldn't burden you with high priority t or high priority tasks like like transport, Otis. If there are any easy requests from your villagers, you may deal with them as you wish. You're such a douchebag. I'm sorry, Otis, I'm rather busy at the moment. Being asked you a student, I wouldn't burden you with prior high priority tasks, Otis. If there are any easy requests from your villagers, you may deal with them as you wish. Well, I guess respect isn't what we're gonna get here. Otis! Glad to see you're awake. Get us around here somewhere, probably by the graveyard. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, I forgot. There was a big red posh guy checking on you before the others came back. He skedaddled be when I came back to check on you. Someone you know? Clear your mind, young'un. These are dark times. Can't rest up in my hot spring, huh? Uh, Getty, if, I, if he wasn't with you, if he wasn't with you, he's probably headed to the graveyard. Can't rest up in my old spring? Okay, Gettys by the graveyard, fine. I'm the grass ma I'm the great master Strix, and I'm smart, strong, and fantastic! I'm Ozio, and I'm stupid! <laughs> oh wait, I got another one. Hmm. <laughs> I'm Ozio, and I'm incompetent! 
extremely incompetent. <laughs> hey now, look who it is! Oh man, it's Scaredy Cat Otis. I heard he was bravely locked up by his mentor during the attack. And that he bravely fainted during the commotion. <laughs> yeah! Not everyone is out to make a difference, Bonacci. That's right. At least we got a crate of food out of Advent before it was too late. Streaks even gave us guard duty over these supplies with the best. Yeah, so beat it, Otis. Got this taken care of. Valley has become a much better place from now. Will become a much better place from now on. <laughs> What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? I don't remember her name. Hi there, boy. The counterattack on the pirates didn't go so well, huh? I suppose I'm to blame for that as well. Don't beat yourself up over it. We have to drink about the future now. The th oh, good lord. Well, that's one way of doing it. But we have to think about the future now. Everyone is talking about leaving Valley to hide from the pirates. They think they'll attack here next. In my opinion, the only way to escape is upwards. You'll see what I mean when I finish my work on this building. <laughs> you want to build a rocket, huh? Everyone is talking about leaving. No professor. <laughs> oh, what do you two smug guys have to say? Get out of our way, Otis! Can't you see we're doing important business here? Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get out of our way, Otis. Can't you see we're doing important business here? Not really. Not really. I'm hungry. Hungry, 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 hungry. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Glad to see you safe, little Otis. Heard you were brave in Advent. Don't push yourself too hard. We must all help out now. Must build new houses for refugees, then keep Valley safe. If pirates come here, we must be ready. I play a song to keep spirits up. Nice one. There you go, song for morale. Must all help out now. Song to keep spirits up. There you go, song for morale. Actually, I'm gonna look at what he does. Right, left, right, 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 left, right. Yes. Right, left, right, 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 left, right. Can I do that in here? No. Right, left. Right, right, right. Left, right. Music master, hi! I mean, it had to be. Key, a key you found in Bombo Man's house. It doesn't look like it would open any doors in Valley. Okay, fair. He plays that song way too often. Let's all help out now. No, oh, oh man, you found my key. Good on you. Guess you remembered my song, huh? Fine. There you go. That was cool. I like secrets like that a lot. Hm. Can't believe it. Hm. What can you not believe?
God. Don't do that again, please. I haven't slept probably since before the pirate attack. Wish I had a bed. Is he, is he drunk? I, I think he's drunk. No. Oh, yeah, if you see my daughter, tell her dinner will be late. That's if she finds her way back at all. Oh. Yeah, you see my daughter. Oh. <sighs> Graveyard, huh? Oh, good lord. Hi, bro. My name is Pip. What's your name? Can't talk, huh? That's fine. I'll just call you bro. Albro. Nice to meet you, Albro. My mom wanted me to come eat dinner. Mm, nah. I want to stay outside, bro. Mm, I'll go home when it's bedtime. Maybe a bit after bedtime. My mom wanted me to come in and eat dinner. Ha ha ha. Confound it! I can't make sense of it. The only thing the pirates seem to have disturbed here in Valley is this ruin. Yet, they destroyed Advent in minutes. If only our plan had worked, the pirates would have been stopped. Katie says the wind machinery was never even active. And how come this island, these islands are sh still shifting? No matter, the pirate threat is far greater. There must have been something inside this ruin that the pirates wanted. That stubborn old fool, fool Azio knows something, but he won't tell me. Could it have been some powerful old owl artifact? Why won't Azio just cooperate? Uh, th this is too much. I can't believe it, Otis. Everything's gone wrong. I can't stay here in Valley. It's been nice to know you, Otis. Goodbye. I don't think we'll see each other again. Wait. You're an idiot. An idiot. Wait. Who's sitting there on that bench? It's the one, the mother. Ah. Uh. So many lives lost. I... I can't believe this happened. I was right there. And I couldn't help. None of the things we accomplished mattered at all. We were doing so great and yet... This is how it all turned out. We failed them. We failed them all. I miss it, Otis. I miss it so much. Even though we, w we never got to fully experience Advent. It's streets, it's culture, the people. We never got to see how it all turned out. Otis. Did we try hard enough? I... I... I don't know if I can go back there, Otis. Do you think it makes any difference what we do from now on? Our future is lost. Our capital's completely gone. Think about it. Pirates destroyed Advent this easily? What are we to do? I... I don't feel like I belong in this village anymore. I've... I failed all of them. 
Is it okay if I stay at our at your place for a while? I need to get away from here. Uh, why do you walk in that direction? I did not give him any input. Uh, he's at our house then. Let's meet him up. Try and meet up with him. Beat yourself up about it. Oh, does I'm not sure what I want to do now. None of the stuff we do seems to work. Maybe everyone's right when they say that we're just in the way. I guess Alphonse knows best. Maybe we should just follow him from now on. He seems to know what's going on. Maybe it's best if you and Alphonse go. Like, without me? Maybe we'll have a better shot if we stay here in the valley. That way we can't mess anything up. Maybe we can get our lives back on track again. Maybe I could finally settle down with... Hmm. Come on, have a tea. Drink a little bit of tea, come on. Not me. <sighs> Poor guy. Professor said it. Azir knows something. A disaster. Had been destroyed. Pirates roaming free. And the professor comes and tells me that the rune holding the relic was opened. If the pirates gather all the relics, then we are all doomed. And with Advent gone, we can't stop them. Otis. You're here, are you? Leave me. I don't want to see you here again. Idiot. Leave me, Otis. I don't want to see you here again. Why do you leave? Why do you leave? Is that really his way of doing things? Psh. Master Otis, it must not be seen here, but we must talk. Let's meet up at your house. We can talk there in private. Ah, Master Otis, Master Getty. Forgive me for hiding in your home, Otis. It would do no good, good if the locals saw you fr fraternizing with a former pirate. Especially after what's happened. Advent is destroyed and there was nothing we could do to stop it. Malstrom and the pirates. Why would they do such a thing? Hmm. Alphonse, is there something you're not telling us? 
Alphonse, if you know something, anything that can aid us against Malstrom, it might help us prevent yet another attack on Veli. You are most certainly right, Master Getty. Malstrom, the pirates, and myself, we were all created by the owls. Huh. What? Your mentor is right, Otis. Molstrom is gathering ancient owl relics, and when he gets them all, he will be unstoppable. I will tell you what I know. No one knows what our original purpose was. Likely we were merely servants for the owls. Using our strength, the owls could reach for higher knowledge. They designed various models, each made for a specific function. We were accept expected to optimize. We would constantly improve our ability to carry out our function. But as you know, the ancient owls and what remained of their cities all but vanished. Without their guidance, we continued our tasks, blindly, for centuries. Molstrom, greatest among the war units, rampaged. Built for war, he always needs something to destroy. No one could oppose him. Those of us who didn't agree to follow him were exterminated. Wallstrom took us to the sky and gave us a new name. Pirates. With him as our captain, we roamed the sky, growing ever more powerful. Until at last the captain heard of the relics. The relics are artifacts of terrible power, remnants of the ancient owls at their peak. To Molstrom, their power is irresistible. Captain Molstrom has found two relics. One that was hidden in Valley, and the other one in Advent. Wait, so you're saying the pirates destroyed Advent just to get the relic? Yes, Master Getty. And now only one remains. If he gets the third and final relic, I'm afraid Molstrom will be unstoppable. Is there nothing we can do? There is, but I admit I'm hesitant. My suggestion to tr try to stop the pirates in Advent put your lives in danger. Perhaps it would be best if we didn't try to meddle with the pirates anymore. The pirates are threatening Valley! We have to try and stop them! What happened in Advent wasn't your fault! I screwed up most of all. My sole duty was to protect us from pirates. If we don't fight back against the pirates, I can't ever make things right. The pirates' next destination will be a ruin called the Floating Continent. It's an ancient owl structure there. The owls hit the last relic that Molstrom needs. We must leave Valley and fly high up into Strato. That is where we will find the floating continent. Then we should go to Strato now. It's the only way we can save Valley. I shall be in hiding here until you get out of the village. Alright, Otis, you ready? Let's go. Strato. I'm gonna drink a little bit of tea. And before we are on our way then, I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope I'll see you in the next episode as well. Thank you very much for watching. And I hope I'll see you next time. Until then, bye-bye.